Hi guys! Today I'm going to give you an unbiased review of the online tutoring service called Yup. I'm Shannon Germain, and this is Nix the Norm! vlog because I love to travel and I wanted to share my love of travel with other people. But here we are in the middle of a pandemic and I'm not traveling anywhere right now. So I thought it might be helpful if I talked about the only other thing that I know a lot about, which is homeschooling. I know a lot of people are trying homeschooling out these days and you might have discovered that honest online reviews of different homeschool curriculums are very hard to find. Most are biased because the people got it for free. I'm going to be doing a lot of these homeschool reviews. So please subscribe and also feel free to comment down below if there's a curriculum or service you like reviewed because I've done most of them at this point. And if I haven't done it, then I probably know someone who has it and can do a review from their perspective. My reviews are unbiased and I paid full price. Today I'll be talking about Yup. Yup is an online math tutoring resource that gives you chat-based tutoring on demand. So that means that if you need help at any time of the day, on any day at all, you can get it. That's exactly what I needed back when I signed up for Yup in the spring of 2019. With Yup, you use an app like on an iPhone and take a photo of your problem. And it was a good fit at first. What I liked about it most was that it was available any time of the day. Basically, for me, all I needed was to use the online tutor to sort of confirm that I had the correct answer. Kind of like if I was in a brick and mortar school, I'd be able to raise my hand and ask the teacher if I was right. And that's exactly what it was for me. And if I was reviewing this last year, I would have given it five stars. But unfortunately, they changed the way they work this past spring. Now, even though I would send them the work that I did to get my answer, they always made me break it down step by step anyway. And that process, when it's done via chat, takes a really, really, really long time. For example, one time I had already done the work and I contacted them just to confirm that I was correct. But they made me go through a process that took literally 90 minutes. I actually timed it. And then the thing that slayed me is that I was already right. So I felt like I was basically being punished for getting the correct answer. This drove me nuts. Let me say again, I had already done and showed my tutor my work. But apparently with this new rubric they have, they make you go through the process anyway. At least that was my experience with it. Now I can understand and would even want the tutor to break down the steps and make me go through them if I didn't have the correct answer. But most of the time, I already had it. So it just got really tiresome and tedious and I'd be so crabby by the time I was done with my work. Now that was just my personal experience with it. And I'm sure other people have completely different experiences and needs. So always keep that in mind because different things work with different people. But for me, it just wasn't suiting me anymore. So I got rid of it and started up with another tutoring service called BrainFuse. And I'll review that one and put the link in the description below. So I hate to be the one to kind of tell you whether Yup is good or bad. Like so many things, it's sort of whether or not it's meeting your particular needs. If you're like me and you just need confirmation as to whether you've got an answer right and you've already done all the work to get that answer, it might not work for you. But if you need someone to sort of take you through the entire process step by step, regardless of whether you know the answer already or not, then it might be worth it. Is it worth a thousand dollars or so? Well, that also depends on whether you have cheaper options like BrainFuse which I use now, available to you. And I guess it also depends on whether your last name is Gates or Zuckerberg. Because if I was in their families, I guess I wouldn't worry about spending a thousand on it. So that's my first of what will be several reviews of homeschool curriculums and tools. 
I hope you like this video and please, please subscribe. Stay healthy and safe, everyone.